today is Saturday the 22nd. Come on, Mama, stop something like crazy. Um, I'm vlogging today because today is my other niece's birthday. What are you looking for? You want one? Let me open it for you. My niece is turning seven, so we will be attending that here. And then Coco's coming over, but obviously since she just gave birth, I believe a week and a half ago, um, she wants to go with me. I literally told her, are you feeling good? She sent me a message and she goes, hey, can I hang out with you today? I said, sure. Obviously, I'm going to go pick you up. You cannot walk like over here. You just give birth. She goes, yeah, I can walk. I'm like, no, you're crazy. I'm going to pick you up. So um, her partner is still there, her baby daddy or she's not married. Her partner's still there, so she's waiting for him to leave, and then I'm going to go pick her up, and then she's going to tag along with me to the party because she wants to go, and I told her, are you sure? I don't want you to be there uncomfortable feeling in pain, or because I don't know what vaginal um, birth is like, so I don't know. I, I If you were to tell me, hey, let's go to a party, I had a week and a half of a C-section, no way. I would probably go with you like two months later. But apparently she's acting normal. She says she feels okay. She goes, just imagine I'm in my, you know, my crazy days. And I'm like, uh, are you sure you're not in pain? She goes, no. So I'm very paranoid thinking she's in so much pain. But apparently she says she's not. I don't know. So when she calls me, I'm going to go pick her up. I'm not going to let her walk. Never. I will never do that. Um, even though she told me no, I'm fine. Um, I'm currently going to put these dishes in the dishwasher to wash. I rarely do that. I It's strange when I do it. I mean, I've been having these for the longest when we moved in here. And we have like a month and a half already here. So I'm going to use it now just because I don't really have much time. It's 9.09 and I still have to make breakfast. I'm going to do some pancakes, egg, and milk. Actually, you know what? I need to go run and get some milk. Dang it! I need to go get some milk. But, yeah, I'm going to put these in the dishwasher and then run real quick to the store, get some milk, come back, and um, I will on my way back pick up Goku almost like she'll be ready, and then make breakfast for all of us. Um, so, yeah, that's our plans for today. I don't really have time. I don't feel like in the mood to wash all these dishes. I literally let them piled up. There's even more here. So, that's that. I'm currently wearing cow slippers because I was in this area and it's cold. Let me show you guys what happened yesterday. I was going to vlog yesterday, but just called it off. I bought Stephanie her very first pair of Nikes. And aren't these the cutest things ever? Like, they are shoelaces free. And it's amazing. It's just like the Velcro one. Awesome. Obviously, she probably will ruin them. But I will try my best and make her not ruin them. So. Just her very first pair of Nikes. She always has Vans and um, Converse. But I decided I'm going to give Nikes a try. Since I'm a Nikes fan of running shoes. It is cold outside. Let me just say that. Let me turn off this fan. It's like 55 degrees. I don't know what's going on. I think we had a cold front or something. Anyways. Yesterday I also went to Buckaroos. Um, it's kind of like a once upon a child. Um, type of thing. I was going there to get a dress for my niece's party but i've never been there so i was like okay i'm gonna give it a try see what it is i was only able to find three pieces let me just say my satisfaction to that place my personal opinion is don't really like it i'll rather stick to once upon a child that place was so small didn't have a lot for stephanie maybe for another um age range probably you'll find more but for stephanie there was literally like long sleeves and i didn't want long sleeve obviously um, there was no shorts. There was only like, jeans and then the jeans that they had were boot cut So I that's not my style. I stick with skinny jeans for Stephanie But I was able to find three things two rompers and a maxi dress type of thing So I'll show you guys this maxi dress. It's from Old Navy um, And I like it and I only paid for it $5.95 which I was okay with paying for this because it's Old Navy you can get this for like $29.99 at Old Navy paying $5.95 was not bad obviously I had to get this watermelon romper you guys know I love watermelon and this one retailed for $4.95 which I was okay but I will do the $4 even not the $0.95 cents. and it's by the Okie Doki brand which is I think you get that at Kohl's I'm not sure but I'm pretty sure it, it was a good price. But like I said, it's just, I don't know. 
And then I got this one right here. It's also a um, romper, which she was going to use today for my niece's birthday party at 5 because it's like a, it's a Moana party, but it's more like Hawaiian than Moana. So I thought this just looks somewhat Hawaiian-ish. I don't know. Don't ask me. But now, since the weather is cold, my plans are officially changed. I don't know what to put her on. Hopefully, apparently, the weather's going to get warmer, around 65 the highest. Still a little bit cold for my little kid's leg, but hopefully it works. If not, then we'll have to stick to jeans and a basic shirt. Buckaroos did not have shirts. They had no pretty shirts. Like, I was so upset. I was like, oh, my God, there's literally nothing here, like. I should have just gone to Once Upon a Child. I always find the best clothes at Once Upon a Child. I mean, like Old Navy. Sometimes I find some uh, kids at Apostle. I bought Stephanie two kids at Apostle jeans there. Uh, you find children's place shirts. Like, good brand clothes there for very cheap. So, I'm just going to stick to Once Upon a Child and not try and book cruise again. It was a fail for me. Um, plus, it had bowls. They were like $7.95, like $8 for a single bowl. I was like, that is insane i am not gonna do that so if you have a four-year-old who wears five-year-old clothes buckaroo is not where to go anyways for those three things was 18 dollars. i was like yeah i could have got more pieces for this at once upon a child you know what i forget to take every single morning my prenatals my prenatals and I think when I go to Walmart to buy my niece's birthday present, I'm going to get Tylenol because I have a major headache. <sighs> I mean, a major headache. Like, this right here hurts. Alright, so Coco just texted me to tell me that her partner is not going to work today, so she's just going to stay home. So that means that she's not hanging out with me today. But, oh well. Okay, so kitchen is done. Stove top is sparkling clean. Um, dishes are done. Dishwasher's still going on. I love opening it. Just see what's going on in there. I don't know. Is it just me? I just randomly open it. I don't know. Anyway, dishes are done here as well. Just gotta let them dry. Then I'm just gonna have a lot of water in the back. Uh, clean that. I don't know what you call that counter. No, that's not counter, but I don't know what you call that. I swept the floor, so the kitchen is done. Clean off. Now, I need to go get some milk to make pancakes, eat breakfast, and then clean up this room because I cannot clean this room with my stomach growling. So I basically clean my kitchen to make a mess in it again. Honey. Nani, you want to go with me to go buy some milk? The aspirator, the food bottle, yeah. Okay, let's go buy some milk. Let's go get some milk. And then my car's way over there. Come on. All right, let's go. I'm ready. Let's go. Stephanie is so cranky. I think it's because she is hungry. I'm super hungry too, Nani. You know that? I'm starving. I can eat something else, but I really want pancakes with some butter eggs. Just sounds good. I'm gonna get two gallons because I've been drinking a lot of milk. We literally got this gallon of milk like a week ago. I used to last us a week and a half. It's shortened to a week just because I'm drinking a lot of milk. Every single morning I am either drinking a glass of milk or I'm making myself some banana milk. Milk. I just love milk. With Stephanie, um, I love milk as well. Uh, but when I'm not even pregnant, I love milk. I've always, don't tell me the gate does not open. Are you kidding me? I gotta go the other way around. Anyways, um, so yeah. When I was pregnant with Stephanie, and when I wasn't even pregnant, I love milk in general. I am a milk drinker. I love milk. Dude, you're going the wrong way, asshole. What, grumpy pants? You're just being grumpy. Come on, grumpy. Come on, grumpy. She has the troll boots on. Come on. 
Where's the keys? Hold on. Okay. Give me a hand. Give me a hand. Foodland. Foodland. All right, guys. I really came to get some beer. No, I'm just playing. I'm not going to get beer, silly. Come on. Milk, milk, milk. You're cold, mama. Oh, I'm sorry. Oh, the milk's way over there. I haven't come to this place like in a long time, so it's like, where's everything at? Who else gets a gallon of milk but always looks at the expiration date and gets the one that's the farthest? Like, this is April 25th, like, come on, that should be in the front. So, I can get May 3rd and yeah, May 3rd right here. All right, let's go, kid. Let's go, kid. Yeah, two gallons of milk. All right, you guys. So I got the two gallons of milk from Foodland. I'm currently waiting on Stephanie. Not Foodland. It is Foodland. That's the name of the store. No. Waiting for Stephanie to get strapped on her car seat. Um, but yeah, I am starving, like starving. So I'm gonna go home and chug a glass of milk. I need something for this coat closet because all our shoes are just thrown in here because it's right by the entrance just like that hi cutie so got the milk I'm gonna chug the last of it right now because because I'm starving. <laughs> and I'm gonna make some pancakes. What do you want? You want cereal? Yeah. What cereal do you want? Red. Red? Oh, Lucky Charms? Oh, I don't think there's any left. There's only a little bit. You want this? Yeah. Oh, all of it. All of it. All right, I'm gonna get to the pancake making. Great, I spilled some in the counter. Are you serious? All right, here, your cereal's ready. I think that looks so appetizing. Which is why I overdo the syrup and I'm starving. I'm ready to eat this deliciousness. Run in the sink. Plate in the trash. I'm gonna be honest with you guys, I have a little bit of nausea. Almost nothing, but I don't think I'll throw up because it's because I waited too long to eat. I mean it is 10 53 and I just got done with breakfast and I woke up at 7. So I waited too long. I'm gonna go lay down a bit and stop like my movements. And that usually works. I was editing the vlog from two days ago, Thursday, Friday, Saturday. Yeah, two days ago. But Stephanie woke up and I found out there was no milk and it just went off. So I'm gonna lay back a little bit right now and then um, edit the rest of the vlog. 
<sighs> so I didn't vomit and I feel great now. It was because like I said, it wasn't a pregnancy nausea, it's just that I took too long to eat to have breakfast. Stephanie is currently watching I don't know what on um, Oh slime videos I guess. Well take it to the sink. Now I'm gonna go ahead and edit. Okay. I was gonna clean the room but that's good. Stop holding me. Stop. <laughs> but you're so cute. I'll tell you why. Anyways, I am. Oh no, don't move it. Oh man. I'm almost done editing. Um, I'm at 29 minutes. That is a lot out of 58. And I still have all this to go. But I'm pretty sure it's because <coughs> I, did, I did dinner and I montaged it. So you see all this right here. It's a whole clip. Which I'm obviously going to reduce to probably 30 seconds. So, yeah, I have a lot to go. A lot to go still. But, yeah, I have Stephanie right next to me. She is playing with her little toys. And she keeps reminding me. She keeps telling me that we're going to be late to my niece's birthday party. But it's not till 5 and it's only 12.16. So, you guys know how annoyed I am from hearing that every 30 minutes. Mommy, we're gonna be late to Mia's party. Like, no, we're not, kid. No, we're not. Excuse the hair. I was laying down and I got a headache. So I decided what if I just um, take off my head, my head, my head elastic thingy. It kind of worked, kind of not. It's 1.43, I haven't ate since breakfast. And I'm pretty surprised that I wasn't starving till now. My hunger just started. So, um, mommy, you want this one? Is that my favorite? That is your favorite. This one. Make her a soup. No. No. Oh, you want this one? Yeah. Okay, well, I'm gonna make her this one. And I'm gonna make this one for me. I love, love these kind of soups. I just love them. So, um, Stephanie wants Roman noodles. I want this one. And the reason why I'm not having a big meal is because I want to eat very good at my sister's, well, my niece's party. She's having a uh, some grilled food, grilled chicken. I don't know what else. All right, you guys, we are all ready. I kind of went with the natural look. Look at this pimple, let's not bother it. But um, yeah, I'm just wearing brown eyeshadow, nothing major. There's no white in here, this one is shimmery. And mascara and a nude lipstick. And just um, concealer under my eyes and where I need it. And then some powder to make it look matte. It is 4.34. I was planning to leave at 4.20. Because I still got to get my niece's birthday present gift. So, we're running a tad bit L-A-T-E. If I say it, Stephanie will start crying because she doesn't want to be L-A-T-E. Um, I hate this tight parking lot. It's so tight. Like, if I go reverse one foot, I'll probably be close to hitting a car. Anyway, so yeah, um, I'm just wearing my regular t-shirt. Stephanie's actually wearing a dress with some tights under it because it is a little bit chilly. And I brought sweaters because I don't know if it's going to get colder later on, which most likely it will. I don't understand why the weather is cold. It was 55, now it's like 60. Um, so it's pretty cold. Not cold, 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 but it's like cold. Like, it's not spring weather. It's, oh my god, this gate does not open. I forget all the freaking time. Go to Walmart to get her a present and then head over to my niece's birthday party. Jose will meet us over there just because he will be coming. He gets out of work at 5. The party's at 5. He won't, he won't get home till like, 5.45. He's going to get ready and most likely take a shower. So, he probably won't be over there till like, 6.30, maybe, which is... If you're Mexican, that's not even late. You're actually on time. La mera hora, what they call it. But, um, still, I'm not a person who likes to be late. 
even though I'm Mexican, I don't like to be late to parties. I don't know. Anyways, but yeah. I'm from Texas, baby, not girl. Stephanie fell asleep. What the heck? Come on, mama. We, but we gotta get Mia's birthday present. You gotta help me pick it. Oh, you're tired, mama. It's okay. Come on. This kid, you're awake. You can walk now, silly. You trying to prank me? Uh-huh. Here, get on this side. Yeah? Yeah. It's not gonna work, kid. It's not gonna work. Gift bag, let me see. Okay. So apparently, I called my niece, the oldest, and she says she likes Shopkins. Apparently, I got the wrong memo. Somebody told me she liked Tony. So I'm gonna get her Shopkins. Now we gotta get a gift bag. Come on. Yeah, it's all her life. Huh? It's all her life. Yeah. Oh look, here's some bags. Well, they don't say happy birthday. Oh, indeed. We got the perfect theme bag. Moana! Here. Oh, you need a tissue. I couldn't find pink or anything, so I think yellow is the best. I mean, there's some yellow in there. So, Will we're going with the yellow. Huh? Huh? Will I gonna be my birthday? I'm going to tell you what I like, okay? Okay, when it's your birthday, you'll tell me what you like. Then I'll get it. I'm currently starving. I mean, starving. So I think I'm gonna give me like a quick chocolate or something to settle my stomach. So I wrapped the gift. I like to like wrap the main gift like here and then put some tissue over it. This looks nice. Then I got some Reese's Pieces for me and Stephanie to kind of calm down my hunger because I will be hangry. <laughs> very very hangry so i was gonna say this go but my car's leaving on and it's 5 11 11 minutes lat but we're good all right so jose just called me and he's actually home he's taking a shower already um he got out at 4 30 that's 5 17 so um me and my sister don't really live far apart probably like 10 minutes from each other so I'm pretty sure by the time I get home and everything, Jose will be ready and we can head over over there. So we can get there at the same time and not be in two different vehicles and take up more space. So I'm gonna go and then just wait for Jose in the parking lot and if he decides to go in his car, then I'll just go to his car and then he decides to come to our my car, then I'll just stay in the car. So I'm going home. So I just called Jose. He's actually already putting his clothes on and his lotion and all that. It is 528, so not bad. We're gonna go in his car. He said we should go in his car. So we're gonna go in his car. I'm currently waiting for him here in the car because I don't want to go up the stairs. And my hunger kind of settled, but I still feel like I can eat a whole turkey, roasted turkey, on my own. Ooh, this is how you put in the princess in the car. Stay in there, kid. Now we're going. That's the that's despacito, mama. Look, despacito. Ah, why'd you take off your sweater, kid? Put it on. And we made it. Oh yeah. We got this lua thingies. You having fun? Yeah. You need to go party? Huh? There's a birthday girl. She's dressed like Moana, apparently. And then here's Jose. <laughs> I like these juice thingies. How they eating? The driest. This is so cute. You know you're Mexican. We're throwing on top of the roof to break the piñata. I miss my brother this time. Dale, dale, dale. No pierdas el pino, porque si lo pierdes, pierdes el camino. Ya le dices uno, ya le dices. Oh. No. 
No, I'm recording. Okay, I'll take a picture now. You did good, Mike Wazowski. You did good. Yeah. <laughs> Porque si lo pierdes, pierdes el camino. Dale, 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 no le dio. Quítale la. ¿Qué sigo yo? My nephew is dangerous. Ah, you didn't break it. You didn't break it. Stephanie's picking up candy. Ah. Pick up my candy. Look at Stephanie. I got these. Daddy to the rescue and help. Oh, she got another baggie. You got a lot of candy? Look, you got two baggies. Oh, she got a bag, right? Yeah. <laughs> what the candy you got? Oh, now you gotta go get one of those pineapple boxes. Tell you to just get. She had a wedgie. Got one? Show me. Oh, you gotta open it like that. What you got in it? Let me see. Wow. Oh, look, you got airhead. Yeah. No. What do you got? Oh, sour one. Mommy loves sour candy. You can take that. I can take this. I don't want to do it again. Okay. Happy birthday to you. I see you, Junior. You eating cake, Mama? Chocolate cake. Is it yummy? Eat it. You got, yeah, eat it. Oh, you got it. I get a date ball. And we are done. We're out. We are leaving. It is. 8.33 and I got extremely cold so now we're going home finally this happens when you have so much fun and you don't need at parties you get home and you're hungry <laughs> I bought her some Popeyes you still have your french fries? she finished her french fries now she's eating her chicken and we are home home sweet home So ready to go to sleep. Hope you guys enjoyed. Thumbs it up. Bye.